What's going on, everybody? Thank you for clicking on another Mass360 YouTube video. We appreciate it. Let us know what types of content you want to see going forward on this channel, and we will make it happen. Like this video if you like this type of content, and please subscribe to the channel so you don't miss our weekly videos. We're coming out with new videos on a weekly basis to make sure you're getting the most out of your Mass360 account, and also to learn a bit more about the MDM and UEM environment and community and what's new within that community and different security threats that are coming up this year and how to be protected from those security threats, right? In today's video, we're focusing on Mac OS or MacBook enrollment. What does that enrollment process look like for both a corporate issued device or a BYOD device? I spoke about these programs on the screen right here in a separate video. You could click above my head right here to check out those videos on Apple to EP, Android Enterprise, or Windows out of the box. I'll keep it short here. If you're issuing out corporate issue MacBooks, you need to take advantage of Apple Business Manager DEP. Get those MacBooks enrolled in DEP because it's going to give you the level of security and control you really need and want over those corporate issue devices. So this is what the process is going to look like for MacBooks enrolled in DEP, corporate issued, supervised control. All right, let's say for a second, I just got hired by your company. Instead of my new MacBook being sent to a central location for the IT team to physically touch, image, and configure that device, which might take an hour or two, right? You're going to drop ship my new MacBook Pro directly to my house in Langford, Pennsylvania. I'm going to rip open the box, power that device on. It's going to search for my Wi-Fi. I'm going to connect to my Wi-Fi. And then a message is going to display on the device configured by the organization that is associated with the DEP token. If you do not see this message on the screen here, you might need to restart the device to reassign the DEP profile to that device. And your telco provider, whoever you're purchasing your MacBooks through, if they're corporate issued, they are more than happy to help you Make sure you get your MacBooks enrolled in the DEP program successfully. You're going to enter your Mass360 local or directory username and password. The one-time passcode option is not supported for Mac OS DEP enrollment. Important to note there. You're going to file these steps to enroll the device. Simple steps, transfer information to this Mac, enable location services. And when the setup is complete, the Mass360 MDM profile it's going to be added to the profiles pan in systems preferences here. And this is what it's going to look like in that profile section within settings. So now that MacBook is fully set up. It takes a couple minutes. It's super easy for that employee to follow the prompts that pop up on the screen once they turn that MacBook on for the first time. And once they're successfully enrolled in Mass360, whatever you need push down to that device will automatically be pushed down once they're enrolled in Mass360. Email configuration, network configuration, applications, tools, documents, whatever that employee needs to do their job will automatically populate on that device following the successful enrollment into Mass360. Again, that's what the process is going to look like for MacBooks, Mac OS devices that are supervised in that DEP program corporate issue. This is rare, but let's say I have a few clients. It's rare though. A few clients that their employees are using their own MacBooks for work. BYOD, bring your own device. They're using their own MacBook for work. That process to get that device enrolled into Mass360, of course, it's going to be a bit different. And because it's not enrolled in Apple B, uh, Business Manager, Apple DEP, the level of security and control you're going to have over that device, of course, is not going to be as strict or vast as the corporation devices that are successfully enrolled in DEP and Mass360. So this is what the process is going to look like. You're going to open the Safari browser, go to the Mass360 enrollment URL. So you're going to push down a Mass360 URL via email to that employee. They're going to click on that URL in their email. This screen will pop up. They're going to provide their credentials, either a one-time passcode that's provided by the organization, or you're going to input your username and password. The employee will. 
you might receive a prompt for ownership type company or personal choose an ownership type and then click continue most of the case here it's going to be personal because we're talking byod accept the terms and conditions and then click continue continue again and you're going to click install to install the mdm mass 360 profile on that macbook the profile installation this is going to require multiple steps to set up the enrollment so make sure that you follow through the setup process where the device enrollment might fail so follow these steps on the screen right here that i'm going to scroll through to enroll that device hit install enter your user and password once this pops up the device is now enrolled you can click continue here or close the safari browser after the mdm profile has officially installed if the profile installation fails, this is important to note, the screen will display the MDM profile not installed status right here. Try the enrollment steps again to install the MDM profile successfully and then click continue. And you're good to go. Now that device is successfully enrolled in Mass360. Remember, you're not going to have the same level of control and security over these BYOD devices that you're going to have over those corporate issued devices that are successfully enrolled in Apple DEP. That's what it looks like to enroll a MacBook through with Mass360 through the DEP program, or if it's not DEP, if it's a BYOD device, what it looks like for an employee's personal device. Again, once they're successfully enrolled in Mass360, everything they need to do their job as an employee of your company automatically get, gets pushed down into that MacBook. There's no sitting around a table, the IT team manually configuring, setting up devices, taking an hour or two hours. Those days are long gone. We're going to completely automate this process where really it's zero intervention for the IT team to get these employees their devices. If you have any questions regarding this process, what it's going to look like for your team, let us know in the comment section below. I'm more than happy to hop on a call or provide you more information or do a video in a bit more detail involving one of our technical engineers to get a bit deeper into the enrollment process for Max. But thank you for watching this video. Like it, subscribe, and look out for these videos on a weekly basis. Thanks for watching, guys. We appreciate it.